Hello, friends. Today we're going to be reading the book called The Dot. Did you notice that's our sight word? The. The Dot. Let's check out this book called The Dot. Look at that. It's a huge version of our sight word. T-H-E. The. Art class was over, but Vashti sat glued to her chair. Her paper was empty. Vashti's teacher leaned over the blank paper. Ah, a polar bear in a snowstorm, she said. Very funny, said Vashti. I just can't draw. Her teacher smiled. Just make a mark and see where it takes you. So Vashti grabbed a marker and gave the paper a good, strong jab. There, she said. Her teacher picked up the paper and studied it carefully. Hmm. She pushed the paper towards Vashti and quietly said, Now sign it. Vashti thought for a moment. Well, maybe I can't draw, but I can sign my name. She's writing right there. The next week, when Vashti walked into art class, she was surprised to see what was hanging above her teacher's desk. It was the little dot she had drawn, her dot, all framed in squirrely gold. Hmm, I can make a better dot than that. So she opened her never-before-used set of watercolors and set to work. Vashti painted and painted. A red dot, a purple dot, a yellow dot, a blue dot. The blue mixed with the yellow and she discovered that she could make a green dot. Vashti kept experimenting. Lots of little dots in lots of many colors. If I can make little dots, I can make big dots too. Vashti splashed her colors with a bigger brush on bigger paper to make bigger dots. Vashti even made a dot by not painting a dot. She's getting quite creative. At the school art show a few weeks later, Vashti's many dots made quite a splash. You know, earlier she didn't think she could do all of these things. Vashti noticed a little boy gazing up at her. You're a really great artist. I wish I could draw, he said. I bet you can, said Vashti. Me? No, not me. I can't draw a straight line with a ruler. Vashti smiled. She handed the boy a blank sheet of paper. Show me. The boy's pencil shook as he drew a line. Vashti stared at the little boy's squiggle. And then she said, Please sign it. The end. Has there ever been something before where it was just really hard for you and you weren't sure that you could do it, but somebody encouraged you to try a little harder and encouraged you that even though you didn't think you were doing awesome, that you really were? Did you see how her teacher made her feel better by framing her dot and telling her how magnificent it was? Then she just knew she could do better. So I don't ever want to hear the words, I can't. We always say, I can't yet. Thank you for reading with me, friends.